So, with that said, let me introduce you to one of the most beloved cars Volvo has ever made. Updated and ready for a new era. The new, the most advanced, and the best ever, XC90. What a fantastic job our team has done. The new XC90 for whatever life throws at you. Our aim with this car and beyond is to ensure that going electric or choosing a hybrid should never be a compromise. Either should be a great choice. Safe, sustainable mobility powered by human-centric technology and beautiful Scandinavian design. And that's what sets Volvo apart. A plug-in hybrid like the XC90 that has an electric range to give you enough for your everyday needs, but also a petrol engine for those times where you need to go further. It's a great choice for many people at this particular point in time, both from a personal point of view and from a sustainability point of view. And we've been looking at how our customers currently use our plug-in hybrid cars. And since this car was launched, of the long-range variants in the past three years, around half of the miles driven in those cars are already fully electric. And that's a really powerful data point. So if you make the most of the electric drivetrain with an XC90 and a plug-in cars, you can have a positive impact on both the driving experience, your wallet, while also making a good impact to the environment. The XC90 is a premium seven-seat SUV with advanced plug-in technology and a long-range drive. The design is confident, and striking, and the digital experience, as you'll hear about more, is fantastic. And it takes the now legendary XC90 formula that has won so many fans from all over the world, and it moves the game on. This car means a lot for us and our customers, and in fact, we've sold almost one million of the second generation XC90 since we launched it in 2015. It is a beloved product, built in Sweden with global appeal selling well in every region, but particularly the USA. As I said before, and I will say again, today is an important day in the history of our company. Today, we are continuing our transition towards full electrification, continuing to build our success as a company based on genuine customer desire and relevant technology. Today is 9090 day, an important day for the EX90 and the XC90. Hi, I'm Florian from the design team here at Volvo, and I would like to talk you through the car. Since we launched the first generation in 2002, the Volvo XC90 has become a true icon. Not just for what it offers, but for how it looks on the road. It's a car that is instantly recognizable in so many places around the world. And we know that people love the XC90 for its robust stance and confident expression. So, we've stayed true to these qualities in this latest iteration, giving the car a new face, which is both pure XC90 and also echoes the design of our very latest cars, the EX90 and the EX30. The clearest manifestation of this philosophy is in the headlights, which give a new twist to our famous Thor's Hammer signature. We've also brought in a new bonnet and bumper to strengthen the car's contemporary appearance. And perhaps most strikingly in a literal sense, we're taking the Volvo diagonal, which has always been around since the Jacob model of 1927, spreading it across the face of the car. At the back, we've deliberately retained the fundamental elements which make the car so recognizable. The subtle and beautiful surfacing of the boot lid remain, as does our distinctive real light signature that we've now modernized in a darker appearance. In short, this could only be an XC90 but it's an XC90 for today and tomorrow, and much better than ever before. This is also true inside. Much like its predecessors, the new XC90 gives you the option of carrying up to seven people and to do so in supreme comfort. Likewise, it still has the option of one of the best-sounding audio systems ever found inside a car, with the Bowers & Wilkins high-fidelity audio system, which can faithfully replicate the sound of a stage, 
a concert hall or a jazz club. Staying true to our strong Scandinavian design ethos, we have made some updates. The dashboard now has a more horizontal and contemporary shape. We've added more texture through premium recycled textiles and split the dashboard with new air vents. We've also reconfigured the center console to make it even more practical in response to requests by owners of the current XC90. The storage space, for example, is much easier to use now, while the wireless phone charger is more conveniently placed. And you probably know that annoying thing when you have a skinny drinks can rattling around in a cup holder twice its size? Well, that's no longer going to be a problem with our new 2 plus 1 cup holder arrangement, which includes a smaller slot just for those times. We've also brought in some new responsibly produced upholstery options. One of them, Nordico, comes from the EX90. A premium option made from recycled materials and bioattributed materials from the forests of Sweden and Finland. There's also a new upholstery option called Navy Herringbone Weave, which is made from 100% recycled polyester. It's a contemporary take on the classic herringbone pattern, finished in a dark blue color inspired by Sweden's West Coast. But the biggest news inside the car is the new user interface, including a large, high-resolution touchscreen with the latest Volvo layout. More on that shortly. For now, let's have a look how the new XC90 keeps you comfortable and safe with Susan Heglund. Hi, everyone. I'm Susanne Heglund, Head of Global Offer. It's great to be here together with you today. As we have heard, XC90 is loved all around the world for its safety credentials, its elegance, its ease to use, and its ability to seat up to seven people in total luxury. With the new XC90, we aim to st stay true to all those qualities while delivering even more quality to our customers. Let's start with safety, which is naturally built into the XC90. In fact, XC90 is one of the safest cars on the road today. It uses a combination of radar and a front camera to keep an eye on the road, looking out for objects and other road users, including vehicles, pedestrians, cyclists, large animals, as we have the living moose here in our native Sweden. And depending on the situation, the XC90 can use braking and steering to avoid collisions. So whether you're expecting the car in front of you to turn, and it doesn't, or a pedestrian unexpectedly steps onto the road, the XC90's active safety system is there to support you. And where it's available, thanks to our connected safety tech, the car can foresee dangerous situations on the road ahead, with the help of cloud connections. If another car ahead of you detects hazards on the road, for example, slippery conditions, you will get a warning. And this is just one example of how we are taking steps to achieve our ultimate ambition of zero collisions involving new Volvo cars. And should the worst happen and a collision is unavoidable, the XC90 goes above and beyond to help protect you. We use a combination of different strength steels throughout the safety cage, in tandem with technologies controlling restraints, airbags, and even the position of the seats. The XC90 is as safe as an XC90 has ever been. It's also more comfortable than ever before. The XC90 comes with a standard of clever new dampers, which mechanically adapt to the current world conditions. If you're driving, this gives you a con confident and relaxed driving experience. And if you're a passenger, a softer ride. And if you want to dial up the comfort to supreme levels, you can configure the car with air suspensions. It monitors the car, the road, the driver 500 times per second to give you the best possible cornering control and truly luxurious ride. No matter what suspension options you go for on the new XC90, you will get peace and quiet as standard. We have introduced a new deadening material and options of laminated options, uh, laminated with side windows, which will contribute to lower noise in the car from the road and the wind outside. And speaking about weather, if it's a cold morning outside and you want to warm up your car before you get into it remotely, you can do that thanks to the Volvo Car app. In short, the XC90 keeps you isolated from whatever the world throws at you. But what about the powertrain? The XC90 
gives you a choice of a plug-in T8 variant and two mild petro petrol options, the B5 and the more powerful B6. These mild hybrids use our kinetic energy recovery systems, which give you up to 15% of fuel savings and emission reduction. In our plug-in hybrid form, the 18.8 kilowatt hour triple layer uh, high voltage battery is capable of up to 70 kilometers of electric only driving. To put that in the context, that's significantly more than the average driver drives every day. So as Jim said earlier, the XC90 can effectively operate as an electric car on your day-to-day -day drive, while the petrol engine takes you further if your plan, plans are suddenly changing. And we know already now that this works for many people. If we look on the total kilometers covered by our new plug-in hybrid cars, the statistics show that around half of them are driven on pure electric. But there are more than just range for the plug-in hybrids. You can choose a combination of petrol and electric power sources to suit your situation. Whether you want full power, constant all-wheel drive for slippery conditions, or if you find yourself driving over a particular rough surface, there is a mode for you. As a plug-in hybrid, it's an electric car for your day-to-day -day drive, with everything else you might need up its sleeve. The XC90 is ready for whatever life's throw at you. Now it's time to hear about how customers will interact with the new XC90. Thank you so much. Hi, my name is Thomas Dovacek, and I lead the user experience team at Volvo Cars. Cars are driven by people, and so for me and the design team, it's our priority to create a really great experience with people at the center, to let them go about their daily lives in a safe, focused and enjoyable way. But today's cars have so many new technologies, new sensors, connectivity, and electrification all converging. And if we're not careful, we can make the experience overwhelming. So we strive to condense everything into a simple approach, making it easier to operate the cars of today. Complexity made simple for life. Inside our all-electric EX90 and EX30, we've applied this approach to create Volvo's new generation infotainment system. And we've had great feedback so far, and we're really proud of it. And today, we're happy to announce that we're bringing that experience to the XC90. To enhance the experience, we've created or we've added a key hardware update, and that is a central screen, making it freestanding, 11.2 inches, and a higher resolution so it looks crisper. So you have a larger, better screen to interact with. But it's the content on the screen that represents the biggest change. Just like the EX90 and the EX30, we've updated the interface with access to common functions and quicker navigation to key areas. So broadly speaking, it takes fewer taps to get to the places that you use most often. Let's take a closer look. The new home screen displays the most frequently needed functions that we've identified through our customer research, navigation, media, and phone. And this means if you want to change something like tracks, you no longer have to navigate to a different application. It's right there on the home screen. At the bottom, we have a fixed bar that gives you access to applications, climate, and settings. And then above that, we have a contextual bar that we adapt based on the situation you're in. So you get your most recently used applications and different controls based on what's happening around you. So if you're driving slowly, we can show the 360 camera when it's most useful. And we're making it easier for you to get the most out of your electric powertrain. If you're a plug-in hybrid driver and you want to put it in a different mode, the driving mode selector is right there. So if you're in the town center and want to switch to pure electric, it's just a tap away. So now the XC90 gets the same new experience that we've brought to the XC90 or the EX90 and the EX30. And all of this comes wrapped in a package that gets better over time with over-the-air software updates. It also shows that we have an interface that can be adapted to different sizes and shapes of screens, which in turn 
helps us make it available to more cars. And this takes me to our next bit of news. We're going to make this experience available in all existing Volvo cars running the Android-based system. And in most markets, those are the cars with Google built in. That's almost 2.5 million existing customers that are going to get this new generation system, which we plan to deliver as an over-the-air update during 2025. And if you're eligible for the update, we'll be in touch soon. Since it's scalable, we've been able to adapt the experience to the nine-inch screen of those cars and getting all of the associated benefits to the customer at no additional cost. This is the hallmark of our strategy to improve the customer experience over time through software updates. So not only are we making a new generation in-car experience that's available to more customers, we're making one that stays relevant for longer, continuously improved by your feedback. And our dedication to creating a safe, focused, and enjoyable driving experience is unwavering. So whether you're driving an XC90, an EX90, or a three-year-old XC40, we aim to make it easier to do what's most important, and that's to focus on the road ahead.